breaking news in the investigation into Senator Bob Menendez. Good to be with you. I'm Gil Mavalos. I'm Adam Cooperstein. Senator Menendez now says that he may blame his wife if he takes the stand at trial. And that shocking development contained in one secret court filings that NBC New York helped fight to get a judge to make them public today. Chief Investigative Reporter Jonathan Deans live in the newsroom for us with more on this breaking news. John. Adam Gilma, Senator Menendez says his defense will be he was not bribed, in part because he might take the stand and say it was his wife, Nadine, who was the one getting the money. And the senator might tell jurors she didn't tell him the truth. The senator's line of defense was filed in secret with a federal judge. Today, that document is now public after the news media fought to get it unsealed. And in those documents, the senator's legal team writes that if the senator takes the stand, his story will clear himself, but that story could implicate his wife, Nadine. While the senator's explanations and marital communications on which they rely will tend to exonerate Senator Menendez by demonstrating the absence of any improper intent on Senator Menendez's part, they may inculpate Nadine by demonstrating the ways in which she withheld information from Senator Menendez or otherwise led him to believe that nothing unlawful was taking place. Menendez and his wife are accused of accepting tens of thousands in cash and gold bars from three New Jersey businessmen in what prosecutors say was a wide-ranging bribe scheme. In exchange, the senator is accused of using his office to help secure overseas business deals as well as interfere with a separate criminal investigations related to the businessmen. This was a past explanation the senator gave as to why he had so much cash in his home. For 30 years, I have withdrawn thousands of dollars in cash from my personal savings account, which I have kept for emergencies and because of the history of my family facing confiscation in Cuba. Now, this may seem old fashioned. The senator, his wife, and two businessmen have pleaded not guilty. A third pleaded guilty and is now cooperating. Last week, a federal judge ordered separate trials for the senator and his wife. Amid news, she has fallen ill and re will require surgery and weeks of recovery. So the senator goes on trial May 6th, and it now appears he might take the stand and possibly point a finger at his wife. With separate trials and spousal privilege, if the senator takes the stand, his testimony may not be admissible at his wife's separate trial. The businessman who pleaded guilty, Jose Uribe, he has admitted he helped both the senator and his wife buy a Mercedes as part of this bribe scheme and that they later made up a cover story to try to fool federal investigators. That is the very latest from the newsroom. Again, Senator Menendez in court papers saying he may take the stand and point the finger at his wife. Back to you.